services, if everyone else is doing it, it's like, there's no shame in raising your price. Like in every industry I have seen, like yeah. lawn care, everything, the, the price has gone up for everything. doesn't matter what the industry is. So uh, a coach has to be able to increase their price. But I, I know why people don't. It's because they're afraid that if I raise my price, my clients won't follow me. Or if I raise my price, new people that could work with me won't do it because I'm not confident with that price. Mm -hmm. So that, in my opinion, like the feedback I get from coaches when we talk about price increase, it's that. And they think that that if I raise my price, my current clients are going to leave because they they don't think they'll be able to afford it. But the reality is they haven't even ever talked to their clients about the new price, about what's included with the new price. So it's, it's more about like packaging up whatever the new offer is like nice and neat. So the current clients can better understand why it's going to be this much. Um, and even the, the simple fact of just telling your, your customers, yeah, like inflation's happening. Like we're, our price is going up. Like it's okay to just be honest with people. Yeah, <laughs> like yeah. nothing, nothing wrong with that. Uh, people get it. Um, mm. I mean, I get emails from, or seen notifications from Netflix. Like they, they've increased their price so much over the past two years. Yes. It's almost yeah. double now what it used to be. And it's like, people will continue to pay it if they value it. They're yeah. not going to care. Like people pay a hundred dollars a month for Netflix. Like yeah. they're, they're not going to care if Netflix keeps raising the price. If they value it enough. They're going to keep paying. So it's the same way with parents. Mm -hmm. what, what are your thoughts with it? Yeah, I think I think I agree with you. Um, I think sometimes what coaches, because essentially what it is, it's like right, it's it's repackaging as as you kind of said. Yeah, it's it's not a case of right. We keep everything the same, but we just increase the price. Right, it's like we change the package. And then we increase the price. So we add something of value, which reflects that price increase. Yeah. Um, but I think where coaches coaches struggle is that because a lot of them think, right, okay, I've got to raise my price, but I keep everything the same. Yeah. And all the major companies out there, you know, they they increase their price, but they'll they'll say why they're doing it. Yeah. 